He'd have been my support through this devastated Debbie McGee breaks down as she remembers beloved late husband Paul Daniels in rehearsals. Last year, she lost her beloved husband Paul Daniels to an incurable brain tumor. And clearly the pain is still fresh for Debbie McGee as she broke down on Saturday night's episode of Strictly Come Dancing while lovingly remembering the magician. The 58-year-old radio presenter was emotional as she watched old videos of their relationship with dance partner Giovanni Panice while also discussing her fond memories of the iconic TV star. While training for the rumba, Debbie took some time out to watch the old films, including one of her wedding to Paul in 1988. During her practice, she revealed, I am really missing Paul. He would have encouraged me through this and been my support. As her aunt Giovanni watched the videos together she added, Giovanni and I have really become mates so it was really nice to share my past with him. Sitting together in Debbie's house, partner Giovanni said, he wasn't just a magician he was. Before the blonde beauty rounded out saying, a showman. The pair hugged as Debbie broke down in the touching scenes ahead of their emotional rumba in Saturday's live show. Debbie, Paul's longtime magician's assistant, married the performer in 1988, enjoying 28 years of marriage before he died of a brain tumor in 2016. She previously revealed, appearing on Strictly has been a dream come true, but it has also served as a kind of therapy. For she is still grieving the death of Paul, the man she describes as the legend I was lucky enough to have as my husband. The famous magician died 19 months ago, just five weeks after being diagnosed with a massive brain tumor. Debbie nursed him through that final month here in their riverside home, having breakfast under the weeping willows in the garden, eating ice creams together while they watched television, never letting him see her cry. After performing the dance to Baby Can I Hold You by Tracy Chapman on Saturday, the judges were wowed by her performance. In Bruno O'Neill's absence, fellow judge Craig Greville Horwood gave his critique in the Italian's typically outlandish style, throwing his arms about and falling off his chair. Her judge Shirley Ballas added that the dance was very emotional. I've lost a loved one so I know what it means. No bells or whistles. A classic rumba. Debbie scored 27 out of 30, topping the leaderboard. Viewers were also won over by Debbie's performance, sharing their love for her in a flurry of tweets, as well as praising her bendy physique during the routine. One posted, Debbie McGee is just so damn elegant. I'm quite envious. Another wrote, Debbie McGee has just made me well up about Paul Daniels. A third proclaimed, Debbie McGee what a woman. I hope I look half as foxy as she does when I'm in my late 50s.